Oh, hey, this is uh, different now. So that's notable. Let's see what we can find in here then. Are the stones blocked off? Oh, there's rats. Oh, I don't like rats. Is there even a path for us to walk? It all looks very blocked off. Doesn't look like we can actually go past anything. Or true anywhere. I mean, there's this rat. It's scared. Steals MP. Ah, uh, that's gonna be annoying, isn't it? Dire rat. Can we steal something from you? Nothing but gratitude. Come on now. You are so very clearly rats that steal things. Surely you would have some stuff. 10 MP. I'm not a fan of that. I'm not a fan of those guys. Okay, let's see. Okay, we could go down there. Let's check up here first really quickly. No. Well, we can get that chest with 50,000 G. Oh, yeah. Okay. So now the pod actually opens up. Shelter. Previously, there was a new. It's asleep, but... Still in the way. Great. We still can't go to the right there. But maybe now we can go to the left. Lapis, always handy. Elixir, thank you, Candy. Oh, what? It's a little hermit? No, it's a reptite. Wait, it's a reptite? Are we gonna attack raptites? Wouldn't that be a little bit of a weird thing to do? Oh, no. oh they're exiles. So those guys have been exiled from the rest of the raptites. Poor guys. And Ayla has been having very poor luck with trying to steal things. Unless they programmed these enemies to just not have things to steal. Which would be... Kind of weird. Okay, I'm just really gonna ice them. Because they do damage. They steal MP. I, I, I don't want to deal with them for longer than necessary. Good. At least takes care of them. Marty levels up again. She's gonna catch up if not pass the others is there anything here it doesn't look like that any chests ah there we go athenian water and i'll leave that frog to sleep so previously this cave was very dark but there's a lot more bats now Four bats, in fact. Let's just try to get rid of them quick. Fire does decently. That shouldn't work. Shouldn't work again. There we go. And then ice to finish these guys off. Thank you kindly. Okay, so we can still get past here. And that gives us the lapis. There's more exiles there. I guess those are exiles anyway. Another turbo ether. There's still one of you goofy faces up there. A steel ingot. 
Not sure what use that has, but I'll take one. Okay, well, it's not dark in here. So does that allow us to, like, memorize a path? Can we have someone build a ladder or something? Whatever. Okay. So I guess now we make our way back again. I guess we'll have to fight these bats. Even though we just beat them. Well, nice. Marty finally learned Cure 2. And actually, I want to check. Is that your last? Nope. You can still deal... Arise. Now, that is one amazing tech. I hope you learn that soon, Marty. Um, you still need Dark Hole. You still need Triple Kick. Okay. That sounds like a really amazing... Uh, tech though for Marty to be able to revive with full HP she might actually be useful I might actually just use her in my party in the end game I mean I'm using her now but that's mostly just because she has techs to unlock ready again so many repeat fights okay fine so we got past there so let's go back and then what do we do do we just advance further into the future lumicide we don't have lumicide can you build me something no you just say you want to and you just say you want to okay um well, I'll use the free heal here. And I guess we're gonna advance further into the future. And hopefully we can advance a bit more. Or we wanna go to the past. At this point, I don't even know. See, the annoying thing is that as an extra addition to having to leave is that little animation and I mean it seems so minor but there's all these enemies that you have to refight over and over because you keep exiting an area and then there's that too and it just it just all adds up and becomes annoying. I don't think we actually want to go here because this is not where I want to go I'm getting 2300, it doesn't exist anymore, does it? Is there still a lost sanctum? I don't think there is. No, that's the abandoned sewers. So we go back to the prehistory. And then we hope that we changed enough to solve it oh wait we weren't even in the right place we weren't even in the right place okay hold on i don't think there's any no i don't think there's anything there anyway okay lost thing taking another look here in 65 million bc Those of tools known as the golden hammer, I'd like you to search for me. It's made from the wood of a golden tree. Okay. There's a patch of golden sand in the flower meadow. Rusted blade. We still don't have a rusted blade. And you still don't sell anything good. Well, we have a new quest now at least. So 
there's that. We are allowed inside of their sanctuary in this time zone. Or time period, I should say. I heard it. Springman gold sent about a young sapling will cause it to produce golden wood. Okay, so do we pick up the little tree from up here and then plant it in the soil? If the enemies are back, I'm going to pull out my hair. Well, it doesn't look like the monsters are around at least, so I don't have to go bald yet. That's definitely good. Oh, there is a monster there. And there's monsters. Maybe I will go bald after all then. Okay. They're, they're like not even a challenge. It, it's literally just a grind because you have to go through them. They're not tough at all. Okay, so the sapling should be here. Can we take it? Can I seriously not take this sapling? Like, it so obviously is this sapling that we need to move. Can I not take it because Magus is like a big evil fiend lord? Like, why is it sparkling if we cannot take it? Isn't that weird? Is that just me? Can someone take it, please? Robo, maybe? Nope, no, nobody's allowed to take it. It's clearly sparkly and important, but... Oh no, don't you dare try and take it when that's probably what you have to do anyway. Magus is starting to advance in level beyond the rest of my party. Okay, I, I don't know then. Like... My obvious thought was, okay, we take the sapling, put it in the golden sand, tree will grow, we can get the golden hammer. But then we're not allowed to interact with the plant at all, for who knows what reason. Do we have to, like, get permission? Well, this is an annoying dungeon. I can attest to that. Do I want to go down here then? I don't feel like I can do much here though. Just the enemies would stay gone. If only. I'm guessing the new is still... Still blocking. I'm guessing there's gonna be absolutely nothing in this cave and we're just wasting our time. That's, that's what I'm afraid of right now. That I'm just wasting my time going here. But, like, we saw the map, so maybe now we can. That's my logic here. Come on, bat. What are you even trying? You're a lone freaking bat. Nope, we can't... Apparently, it's literally impossible to memorize a map for these people. It's, it's impossible to memorize that... It's literally just a straight staircase. Okay, so Magus learned a new deck. But he still has one more. Still has one more tech to go. Uh, you still had a rise to go and you still have triple kick to go. Even though we're doing all these repeat battles, getting all this TP... We still have more and more to go. That's, that's the sad thing, right? Even with all this grinding feeling. 
So we have to bring the sand to the tree. Rather than planting the tree in the sand, we're moving the sand. Not a sapling, but the sand? Because logic? I mean, wouldn't it make more sense to be like, okay, the ground here is good. Let's move this tiny sapling that we can easily just hold in our hands and move that over and plant it in this soil that already exists here. No, instead, we're going to take loose sand that you can't just carry, you know, unless they have pocket sand now. You know, Magus is just going to reach into his pocket in the next battle and just throw sand in the enemy's eyes. Like, that that doesn't make sense to me. That, that, that would be so impractical, but that's what we're going with, apparently. Fine. <laughs> you know, they want to carry sand... They can carry this freaking sand all the way to the stupid sapling and please can they just do this without giving me weak as enemies. Okay, we're through there. We'll sprinkle the sand around because sprinkling a tiny bit of sand around will totally make all the difference in the world. Alright, now we just have to wait for it to ground to a tree. How long do you suppose that will take? Oh, what if we came back here to the other gate in the Middle Ages? Maybe it would have already grown. Gee. What a theory, Ma Marley. What a theory. We've only been time traveling the entire game. Okay, whatever. I guess that's a good hint for if you're confused on where to go next. But, uh, I guess this... This side quest is getting a bit on my nerves with all of the enemies respawning every time and you're being forced to go back and forth in time because the enemies just keep... Because you have to. You, you have to do it over and over. It's not like you can get everything done in one time, travel and then maybe come back once more or something. No, it, 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 it keeps being this back and forth. And, uh, okay, whatever. Middle Ages. Hopefully, we are getting close to done with this place. And just in the event something happens, I'm gonna do a save. Okay. So, now what we want to do is, have you done anything yet? No, you're still talking about building the bridge. I'll take a free rest, sure. Heal up those few hit points and MP that I lose battling the same enemies over and over and over and over and over and over. Okay, please tell me the sapling is there. I'm gonna have to fight enemies along the way, I already know it, but as long as the sapling is there and we can move on, I'll take it. No enemies? Really? You're, you're making me too happy, game. Okay. Well, there we go. Wait, just... Just the one, then. Are you alone? Where are your friends? What, what are you doing here all alone? Shouldn't you have more buddies than this? Did they all ditch you for your birthday party? So now you have this rented bouncy house all on your own? <sighs> Whatever. No tree. No shiny tree. Hey, let grow. Why no here? Look, gold hammer. Okay. Wait. So he took the golden hammer from our golden tree. 
He is fled. Wait. He is fled? You mean he fled? Or he is gone? Whatever. He cannot have gone far. Well, gee, Willikers, I sure hope so. I sure hope so. I'm guessing he's not over here, though. Okay, well, let's go. Let's, uh... Start our chase. If you will. Not in here. Just checking every nook and cranny. I don't want to have to go back through here. Yeah, I really feel like the enemies here just aren't programmed to have items. Because else I would be way too unlucky. Okay, hey. Here's the guy. So I guess this is the boss of the area. Gold hammer. Well, I'm gonna charm you. Nothing but gratitude. And your attack increases? I don't like that. I don't like that one bit, actually. I'm not doing anywhere near enough. I want something from you. Boulder, this is gonna hurt. 275. Black hole? Let's try that. I wanna see what it does. Yeah, we can't charm. We can't. We just can't charm. Okay, I guess that's something that isn't gonna work on bosses. Um. Sure. Let's do some dual attacks because I didn't equip any gemstones yet, which I meant to do. To test out some triple techs. Let's try Dark Mist. Six ninety four. Your attack keeps increasing, unfortunately. Dino Tail, Tail Spin. Let's try it. Try Dark Bomb as well. 631. This attack keeps increasing though, so we might be screwed here soon. 693. Uh, let's actually do a Cure 2 on Magus. Oh, that just cures only him, but to a large amount. Oh, that pretty much just cures him entirely. Well, I'm down with that. Um. Dark Bomb did pretty well. Reduce HP to 1. Well, that's not very nice. Although, if she lives, we can Dino Tail, which does a lot of damage if her HP is low. This is dangerous, though. Okay, first of all, Cure 2 on Magus, then you... Dino Tail Gold Hammer. Then you. Dark Bomb, because why not? This should do a lot of damage, right? 700? That's disappointing. At least that doesn't do any damage because your HP was already at zero. But still, that is incredibly disappointing. Well, we beat him. Got 10,000 G. Finally got you. Sorry, but we need the hammer. Okay. So, first of all, I want to check if it's... Is it a special item? It is. And the steel ignot, ignot, ingot is as well. Uh, okay, so 
Let's uh, make sure you're healed. Just in case we run into any fights, I don't want to lose Ayla immediately to any shenanigans. Okay, and we're almost through here, I think. I mean, we have the Golden Hammer, so that's one more quest done at least. Although we're in the wrong time zone, aren't we? Yeah, you're not there, you're not there. Right, Lumicide, okay. So, back we go once more. I'll just enter back in here. Okay. So now we're back in 65 million BC. Oh, this is it. The Golden Hammer of Legend. Would you give it to me? I will make it well worth your while. A hundred thousand. That's a lot of cash. <laughs> 